All right, welcome back, everybody. This game is War Tales, and I want to, uh, I guess, give a shout out to Shuro Games. They actually provided me the game key to play this a while back, and I didn't get a chance to to play it. And so I'm finally getting around to spending some time to check out this game. I did play a very, very early demo version of this game a long, long time ago before they even released it into early access. And it looked really fun. Um, I enjoyed it because it's very similar to Battle Brothers. I definitely like games that... Um, let me lower down the music here. I, I definitely enjoy games that's open world where you can actually create a party and roam the uh, map, the world map, and build up your character stats and then do some combat and some role playing. So this is um, a tactical based game. So let me go ahead and do a new game. And jump in here and see what's going on. So I have not played the full version yet. Um, so I don't know. They've made a lot of new updates. And I think they recently added some DLC too. Um, so yeah, let, let's figure this out. What, what do I want to do here? Your companions are apprentice friends looking for an adventure, men escorting merchants who lost their employer, deserters fleeting, fleeing an abusive captain, young farmers looking for a better life, bandits looking to escape the guard, apprentice looking, friends looking for an adventure. Okay, well, men escorting merchants who lost their employer. Or young farmers looking for a better life. Okay, they start with bread, but they're not happy, right? Starting companions, spearmen, archers versus this one. They have some sort of influence, but their raw materials are minus five. I don't know what that means. I guess you get less raw material when you start. Oh, okay, I guess there's less raw material. All right, well, let's go with the apprentice, right? Because we get some archers too, right? And, and rangers. Yeah, let's go with this. That's fine. I'm okay with this. We get extra influence. Yeah, I really enjoy Battle Brothers a lot. I haven't had a chance to stream that. And it's been a while since I've played it but I definitely enjoyed it when I did play it. All right, so are you... Okay, your companions are used to long walks, are cunning fighters, show incredible resilience, are excellent at slap games, crit, crit damage increased by 10%, right? Experience gains from each profession is increased by 10%, quick learners. Reduce the speed at which the troops fatigue stacks by 10%, okay. Experience gain in combat increased by 10%. Influence gain after a battle increased by 10%. Oh. Interesting. I think I want this one, right? It's experience gain in combat increased by 10%. So we're going to be doing a lot of combat. I think that might be okay. All right. Next option. So what we're doing here is we're crafting our, our initial starting group. building our party if they had a flaw it would be a somewhat meek appearance each companion's carrying capacity is decreased by one reduces the troops happiness by one during each rest mm. crit reduced by three percent a common uh, bout of bad luck common but yeah a very hard time in getting up during uh, danger during rest increased by ten percent Ooh. Willpower is reduced by one. A serious lack of self-confidence. I don't know about reducing my carrying capacity. I like to carry stuff. I like to have inventory space. Let's see here. What else? During rest? No, right? 
guess I can give up carrying capacity. Alright, so what, what are my choices here? Exploration mode. Adaptive exploration. The difficulty of all the re regions adapts dynamically to your group size and your unit's power. The game will always offer a challenge suited to your group. Region lock exploration. Each region of the world has a set of difficulty from the start. You will have to expand and improve your troop for, before you can explore more dangerous areas and fight more enemies. Okay. I kind of like the idea of region locked because when you build up, you level up, you never feel powerful. And this is the left is kind of like Diablo's difficulty scaling. And I really didn't enjoy the idea of after I become awesome, things just doesn't feel awesome anymore. At least with this, I can always feel awesome and then move on to the next challenge, right? Let's go with this. Alright, so starting region, combat difficulty. You want an easier combat experience. You can change the difficulty at any time. Let's go with experience. I don't want to say novice. Survival difficulty, right? Um, manage, management difficulty is tailored to be flexible and un unintrusive. You will need to manage your companion's hunger, fatigue, and wages daily. Oof. Huh. Let's go with experience. That's fine, right? Save mode. Only one save per game, but you can go back at any time to certain checkpoints, like the last village you visited, the beginning of the battle, etc. You can save at any time and make multiple saves of the same game. Sure, let's go with free. At least it's not Iron Man, right? Alright, let's go with that. Alright, we have people to name, I'm sure, right? I think. Yeah, we can rename people. So who wants to be named in the game? Well, well you know what? I'll pull, I'll pull all of our subs here. We'll, we'll use subs. That's currently in channel. So... You will be Aquin. Ak... Kawin. And I'll come back and do the traits. You know what? I'll give you a trait. Aquin, what do you want here? Random positive. Add a random positive. Constitution, huh? What's his ability? Damage? He's got first aid. Heals a dying person, removes all stacks of poison and bleeding. Okay. He's got melee strength. Alright, well, since he's got melee, I guess I'll give him strong. And then, I want him to be quick, right? I don't know. Aquin must consume alcohol every meal to be happy. Glut will eat plus one each day with an appetite. Jesus. Costs plus three in wages. Earns less professional experience. Gain less experience. Crit hit reduced by 3%. Uh, what game is this? Oh, I have a, have a character, yes. So this game is War Tales. It's um, similar to Battle Brothers, where you roam the world in an open world setting, and you have a party, you know, that you can manage and move around, probably pick up new party members later. It's tactical based. Now, Aquin, you gotta tell me, what would you like to be for a negative trait? Since I, I since you seem to be a melee user here, right? Deals damage, this is melee strength, I decided to give you strength as your positive. 
I decided to give you a movement, so you want to be able to move fast, right? If you're going to be a melee user, right? And then the the negative, here are the negative choices, right? Well, uh, Glutton will eat uh, extra food each day, so basically you're consuming more... You're a, basically a food drain. I don't think that's a good idea, obviously. Costs more in wages, so I'll have to pay you regularly a little bit more by three. Your professional profession experience is you earn less right so whenever i improve your experience like your first aid or your healing or whatever it is that you do you get less experience you're stupid overall you get five percent less experience in general you're unlucky your critical hit is reduced by three percent you're depressed willpower i don't know what willpower does okay so i don't know if that's worth anything. Willpower is reduced by two. And then drunkard, you have to have alcohol with every meal to be happy, which we may not have alcohol every meal. So you're probably gonna be depressed forever. Um, I don't know. Maybe willpower, maybe cost more in wages, maybe depressed or pickpocket. Willpower reduced by two. All right, well, let's go with that. Oh, you know what? Let's see here. Do you want facial hair or no facial hair? Huh. No beard. All right, no beard. All right. Long hair, short hair. Punk rock looking hair. Monk looking hair. Or bald. This is the monk looking hair. Punk rock hair? Alright, you want the punk rock hair. Alright, that is you now, Aquan. Color of the clothes? Yeah, that's... that's See here. What kind of color clothes you want? Purple, red, brown, gray. Purple. Brown. There is green, yes. There's a green. Alright, there you go. You're green. That is you. Now, Brian. I don't know if you're still watching or not, Brian, but we will give you... A character and I think Annie is also in the chat so we're gonna give Annie a name Brian what do you want Brian I think Brian can be my my archer Brian Brian this is now you and Brian is my archer. He is pretty fast at running, right? Oh, Brian, you're in the channel too? I am here, okay. So Brian, how do you want to customize this? And we'll do Annie next, if Annie's still watching. I'm trying to use players who are subs right now. Give you guys a little perk for being a sub. So Brian, what kind of face do you want? Do you want to look like a young guy, an old guy? Brian is gonna. I don't. I don't bother much with appearance. Okay. All right. All right. So we will give Brian some. Eh, you know what? We'll, we'll make him a young guy. I don't like any of these facial features. Or we'll give him like a purple... purple color scheme so I can distingu distinguish him from the others. Alright, that's Brian. 
And then we're gonna give Brian what trait would you like? Let's see here. Since you are a archer. Oh, dexterity, right? Probably nimble, right? I think dexterity is part of an archer skill set. We'll go with dex tight, dexterity, nimble. And then another positive trait, right? Critical hit. Wage reduced by 10%. 3% base to guard. You're not a melee, so I don't think that matters, right? We can go with strength. Or we can go with crit hit increase by 3%. Bloodthirsty. I think that might make more sense. I would say quick or bloodthirsty, right? Yeah, that's why I was thinking too. Alright, let's go with bloodthirsty. Give you a critical hit. Alright, so what negative effect... Or negative trait would you want it's the same as the choices i gave aquin earlier all right pickpocket stupid scrawny reduced carrying capacity by three willpower reduced uh, by two must consume alcohol if you're a drunkard oh Scrawny? Alright, let's... Constitution? Alright, let's go with Scrawny. Oh! Oh, shit! Oh, my God. I clicked on... Oh, my God. I didn't get... Oh, I didn't get to make my other two. Shit. I accidentally hit the start button. Oh, my God. I wanted to... Customize the other two guys. Your companions are off in search of adventure. Okay. After a few days of quietly traveling along, their only feat was not getting lost, and they have reached their destination. Here surely awaits some novel and exciting quest that will stir up uh, the uneventful lives of bored apprentices. Adventure awaits at the end of the road for those who make it their alive, that is. Okay. I wonder if I could still modify my characters. Oh, I can still at least rename them. But I can't pick new traits. Yeah, I can't pick new traits. I can't modify their looks. Yeah, I can't modify looks. But I can at least rename them. So let's go ahead and rename this. This will be Annie. Annie. Annie Gillitator. Gillitator. Right, Annie Gill. Did I spell that right? Gillitator, right? Yeah, Annie Gillitator. And you are a ranger. I can't change your looks. I can't change whatever traits. And then this guy here. I guess I'll. I'll, uh, who else is in channel that is a sub? The Hatch, right? The Hatch was a sub earlier. So, The Hatch, you are now in the game. That will be you. Alright, so... And Hatch is also hardworking. Well, he's a melee guy too, right? He's weak and forces the target to engage in, and inflicts weakening. To one round. And that's what's up. Yeah, so you are now the hatch here. This is your character. So we've got all subs in the party. And it's time lapsing. Yeah, time is lapsing. Whoa, what's just happening? I just hit the up arrow key. I hit W. I don't know what the W does. Power and glory. I don't know what this does. Is there a tutorial? Is there a tutorial? Escape key. Is there a tutorial? Display tutorial, right? Enabled. 
All right, well, hopefully there's some sort of tutorial because I have no idea what's going on here. All right, well, let's continue then. What do I do? Let's walk over here. I think I can collect loot from the world, right? Is there a slow speed mode? Is there a speed difference? Oh wait, oh my god, we're getting rushed. We're getting attacked, guys. Alright, let's fight. We don't have a choice, right? A hoodlum and a poacher wants to attack us. Alright, what's, what's going on here? When your turn comes, play any unit you haven't y used yet in the round. You can find out which enemy will then come into play. Prepare your strategy. You can find out which enemy will, will then come into play. Prepare your strategy. When your turn comes, play any unit you haven't used yet in the round. Okay. Okay. I think you start off by placing where you want to be on the map, right? I think this is like a starting position, right? You can place a companion here before the battle starts, right? And Annie Gillitator, Aquin, and this guy here is a range unit. This guy looks like a melee. He's got a knife there, right? <laughs> Annie Ag Agitator. All right, hey, all of our sub members are here. Okay, Hatch. Let's see here. I think right here is fine. Yeah, you know what? Hang on. Let's put Aquin over here. And then... Let's put Annie Agitator... Over here, where's Brian? You are good right there. Hang on, let's move you over here. Put Brian over here. And then any agitator can probably rush in and take this guy out, right? We want to rush this guy. Alright, this looks like a fair positioning, right? Can I rotate the screen? No, right. Oh yeah, there we go. Right click, right? Right click! Holding right click down, I can rotate the map. Alright. And then what do I do here? Alright, so kill- okay, hang on. Do I pass my turn? End Brian's turn? Oh, okay, I can make movements. No, hang on. I can't make movements, right? I think I end my turn. Where do I make an attack? Oh, I can make my... Okay, so I can place it wherever I want, and then I can do, I can do my... My attacks. Alright, so... The hatch is gonna run over here and take out the poacher. And we're gonna... Deal damage here. Nice, nice, nice. Engage. Okay, when you perform a melee attack on a free enemy, you engage them. An engaged unit can only attack their engaged opponent and has a higher chance of taking critical damage. Take advantage of this with your other units. An engaged unit is exposing their back. Attack them from behind to get a bonus. So this guy is an, an engaged unit, right? An engaged unit can only attack their engaged opponent, so they can only attack me. It has a higher chance of taking critical damage. Take advantage of this with your other units. When performing a melee attack on a free enemy, this is considered a free enemy, I guess, you engage them. Okay, continue. All right, so I can't place my position anymore, right? So I made my first attack. Oh, okay, okay. So I can't do any other movements. 
Let's see, what is this? Disengage or taunt. Force a target to taunt and inflict inflicts weakening to them for one round. Damage reduced by 50%. Weakening that damage reduced by 50% and inflicts weakening to them for one round. Damage is reduced by 1%. Forces the target to engage and inflict weak weakening to them for one round. And then they weakening means their damage reduced by 50%, right? Oh, damage to us, right? Damage to us. Let's do that. All right, so he's weakened. It spends points not free. Oh, okay, right, okay, it spends the points. Okay, okay. I'm pro This is probably me, right? I'm probably on the next turn. You can use any units that hasn't taken part in, the, in this round. Alright, let's go ahead and end this guy's turn. And then it's my- okay, I get another turn, right. That's my current turn. And then, uh, Brian... Oh, I could choose any unit that hasn't taken a turn yet. Okay, very good. Alright, well, Brian, no. Let's see, Aquin, right? We're gonna engage this guy so he doesn't move anywhere else. And we're going to... Pound him, right? Deal five, five, four to five to the target. Damage is increased by 50% if the target has armored. Oh, okay. That's first aid. Smack. Oh, his armor just went down. Okay. Engaged. Okay, I'm gonna end Aquin's turn. I don't think I can do anything else, right? And now it's their turn. Oh, shit. Aquin got poisoned. All right, that guy is not in my range. Disengage and move in a straight line. No, I can't choose that right now. I can only choose this one. All right, we're gonna shoot that guy, right? Oh shit, oh, I hit my own guy. Oh my God, Aquin and Brian's relation has deteriorated. Oh my God. Bail! Bail. Did I, did I hit Aquin by accident? Or... Oh my god. Oh no. Shit. Sorry, Brian. Friendly fire. Okay, friendly fire. Bad. End turn. Is there a rotation? Is that do I face this direction? I don't think I can face change the facing direction. All right, so this guy is my guy, right? Let's go ahead and walk over here and smack him, and then oh, I can't back. Oh, I can back step him. Nice. Agitator, what is this? Heals a dying ally for 10%, removes all stacks of poison debuff and burning. Cannot be used if this unit is engaged in combat. I'm not engaged in combat, right? Can I spend it on my guy? I don't think I can spend it on my guy. There you go. Okay, there you go. I can heal like a nice, nice. So Aquin is no longer poison. Few skills, mostly rogue, better to do behind targets. Yeah, I probably needed to do that behind the target. That's okay. These are like the first initial group. Should be easy, right? Nice. I didn't. I didn't get really a good 
kill off of him, but yeah, you know what's fine. Alpha, go ahead and pound this guy. Oh, he took it to the face. <laughs> to the face. Kill three enemies with a single AoE attack. I only killed one. I don't know what that was. Okay. That guy definitely took it to the face. So the hatch has no more available moves. Oof, I, I bombed him good with my big bat. Yeah, you did. Damage increased by 50%, but I have no more points on him, huh? So the hatch is out of points, I think. Or out of the ability to do anything. Oh, it's Aquan's turn. Never mind. It's still Aquan's turn. Alright, let's go ahead and walk up to here. And then end your turn. Alright, so now the hatch can do something. And then the hatch can disengage. Now let's go ahead and end, tur end turn. And then now this guy. I'm, oh my god! I'm kind of worried that I'm gonna accidentally shoot somebody here. Okay. All right. Nice. Three units around target make debuff. Oh. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. A new round is starting. Oh, this is easy peasy. Who wants the finishing blow? What is 10% versus 0%? What is 0%? Alright, well, let's go, let's go with the hatch. Hatch, you're gonna at least give this guy a smack here. Oh, right in the gut. <laughs> Right in the gut. Armor. Nice! My first battle. Do I want to repair all? Repair damage, armor, and shields with your raw materials. Sure. Repair armor for raw materials. No, probably not. Let's not. Let's do that next turn. All right, what is what is this here? Probably useless remains. Then again, cloth. Let's take the cloth. I don't know what can I do with remains. I don't know what can I do with human remains. You know, let's take all of it. Yeah, let's take all of it. Let's continue. Brian just leveled up. Aptitude points. Aptitude. Aptitude points can be used to improve your your companion's attributes. Feed them to the harpies. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Brian has a option here on level two specialization. Every time this unit kills an enemy, you gain one something. What is that one something? What is that one thing? Every time this unit deal. Unit ends their turn next to an ally and is not engaged in combat, you get one thingy. What is that one thingy? Points for skills? Okay. Every time this unit ends their turn to to an enemy and is not engaged, turn next to an enemy, right? What about this one? Every time this unit ends their turn next to an ally, oh. And is not engaged in combat, you get points. Or do I want every time this unit kills an enemy, you gain skill points? First looks better for... First looks bad for archers, yeah. Yeah, that's bad for an archer, for sure. I mean, this one, if I kill somebody as a final blow... I think that's pretty good, right? Or this other option is I have to stand next to one of my allies. But the problem with that is all my allies are, are melee units. So let's go with this one.
Do I get another one? Oh, 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 I can distribute this. Yeah, I think this is good, right? Yeah, why not? Why not? Can learn recipes and craft uh, camping. Okay, cool. Plus plus means give you two points. Oh, I should have gone back, huh? I'm taking the plus plus. Shit, I screwed that up, didn't I? Okay. Yeah, interesting. Okay, all right. Well, let's see here. Move along. Not necessary. It's good for him, of course. Oh, okay. So I'm... Hit the W key. Now, what is this W key? I guess I can't scroll around the map. Or can I? No. I, I want to hit the W key because of the ASWD. Shortcuts. Camp is C. Path is W. World map is M. There's no ASWD, right? C camera up, camera down. Okay, yeah, that's ASWD only during combat. Okay. Alright, so during the world map, W is bad. All right, I'm going to rebound this key because I don't want to accidentally hit it. During the world map. Because I'm always hitting the ASWD. All right, let's go here. Okay, there's a little farmers or something over here. Plateau stables. Cool. What is this? Can I zoom in? Oh, hey, I can rotate the screen. Can I zoom in, though? Alright, let's inspect this guy. He's got some skills, right? He, does, he, he, he can fight. Will this guy... When I think about many people don't shoot their ponies... It makes me want to pull out the little head I have left. Okay. I wonder if this guy will buy my dead bodies. Tell you what. Buy a horse from us, and I'll throw in the horseshoes for free. Do I want to buy a horse from this dude? I don't think I should buy it. I think I sell for one. Oh, he does buy the bodies for like one coin. Right, it's better than nothing, right? He does buy it. Oh, I don't want to steal anything off of him, right? Although the war in Ederim has been a boon for my business, I cannot help but feel for my poor ponies. Hmm, bodies are u are useless, so not bad for two coins. Yeah. All right. We got two coins for the bodies, right? I can tell you aren't soldiers. Take them with you if you can. Otherwise, they would most likely end up dead on the battlefield through no fault of their own. I can tell you, you aren't soldiers. Take them with you if you can. Otherwise, they will most likely end up dead on the battlefield through no fault of their own. Are you giving me a horse? Although the war in Ederim has been a boon for my business, I cannot help but feel for my poor ponies. Ponies? I can tell you aren't soldiers. Take them with you if you can. Otherwise, they would most likely... Oh, I still have to buy it. Take it with you if you can. Yeah, I think she wants me to buy it. How much is this pony worth? Oh, the whole pony has a wage requirement. You talk to the ponies? You can talk to the ponies? Dexterity is increased by 5%. Carrying capacity is 50. 
454. That's a terrible carrying capacity. Carrying capacity is reduced. Must consume meat or fish every meal to be... Oh my god, these ponies are like just another person. Alright, this guy is pretty good, right? This guy is a very good pony. The question is, do I buy it off of her? Or do I take it? Oh, you adopt him. This creature seems to be begging for you to take with you. Recruit. Oh, I have to buy it. I don't know about that. I don't have a whole lot of money. That's my entire bag. No, definitely not. I'm sorry, I can't buy your stuff. No, we don't want to steal this guy's thingy. Alright, well... He wants to sell his Tell shoes, what, right? Buy a horse from us, and I'll throw in the horseshoes for free. So, 108 bodies and it's yours? <laughs> okay. Alright, well... Let's go, let's leave, right? Well, yeah. Let's go. Let's not, let's not hang out here. We don't have the money to pay for any of those. Alright. Hang on, what about the world map? Oh, okay. It's kind of cool. I like the world map. What does this say? Buy a pony to be eligible for the special offer. Okay, well, I don't want to buy a pony. Okay. Bonfire near? What's bonfire near? How can you tell if there's a bonfire near? How can you tell if the bonfire is near? What 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 does bonfire near mean? Near horse selling? In the woods? Go this way, right? How can you tell there's a bonfire near? You see it. You see it now, right? Uh, maybe. I don't see anything. I don't see anything, but other than loot, right? I see loot. I don't see what you're talking about. It have not bad loot. Was that the loot you were talking about? How do you know there? I, I didn't see that bonfire. It was just like a shiny loot though, right? What is that? What is that? Progress made in your discovery says earn you knowledge points. Okay. Strom cap, right? Ooh, what's this? Inspect? Oh, inspect. Oh, I can't. I have to catch up to the guy to inspect it. Let's go into this town. Oh, well, what is this? Oh wait, we're going into town. The town hall. Let's talk to the mayor. Are you mercenaries? I'll have you know that we do not take kindly to refugees in these parts. Uh, I'm either a mercenary or a refugee. <laughs> or both? Why? You ask? Because they have overrun our streets and are now taking to the roads. Erdogan is sending our way anything with legs and a mouth that cannot wield a sword. Okay. Well, I'm not a refugee. I'm probably mercenaries. You have your work cut out for you. 
There is no lack of honest folk in need of help to fend off the refugee menace. Okay, we're not refugees then, yes. <laughs> Alright, what else do you have going here? Oh, she's, you know, I don't want to attack her if that's a bad idea, right? It's nothing to her, her to steal from. No, we don't want to steal her shit either. What is this? What's, what is this? The forge? Oh, what is this? New profession blacksmith. Hmm. Hey, fat boy Carrie, what's going on? Um, I don't know. Do I... Give one of these guys a profession? How's the game? I, I'm I'm liking it so far. I mean, I dig this type of game. This is my kind of my style. I I used to love playing the original Darklands back in the days. And this game here reminds me of Darklands. Um, I also enjoy Battle Brothers. So this has a lot of Battle Brothers vibe to it, right? Profession give you passive stats too. All right, so should I should I give one of these guys a profession? I mean, the the swordsman is probably a good idea, right? Making him a blacksmith. Confirm. Hatch the hatch will become a blacksmith. Okay. And then now, what can I do with the hatch? What is this? Craft once to reveal the superior set in the compendium. I have zero knives, right? Oh, I don't have the resources to craft it. I don't have the ingredients. Yeah, I don't have ingredients. All right, let me exit out. Oh, Alright, well, that doesn't matter, right? You can use my anvil. I can also repair your armor. Oh, and I'm looking to hire a skilled blacksmith. If you happen to know one. Okay, how much is it to repair? Eight coins? Yeah, let's repair for eight coins. A few dents here and there. Nothing more. Thank you. There. Good as new. Good as new. Alright. Let's see here, hang on. I want to... I have a weapon here, right? It's got dexterity plus three and poisoning skills. And then... A ranger, huh? Well, this guy looks like he can probably use a better... Weapon here, right? It's definitely better, right? What's the damage on this? Six to seven. That's also six to seven. It's, it does backstab, though. What's backstab skill? What's backstab skill? Versus poisoning skill. But it also gets plus dexterity. Increases the skill damage based on dexterity and critical hits. Okay, let's see here. So if I put this there, he does six to seven with poisoning. Lose five percent of their health at the end of their turn. Okay. And applies poison. Actually, that's not bad, right? That's not bad. They also lose an extra five percent of their health at the end of their turn. I think this is good, right? Yeah. And then... I wonder if I could sell that. I could, maybe I could sell that, right? Go ahead and talk to this dude. Can I sell the... the you weapon to you? Anvil. I can also repair your armor. Oh, and I'm looking to hire a skilled blacksmith. Sell for 16, right? Let's go ahead and sell that. Can't equip two daggers? Oh, that's a good question. Shit. Well, <laughs> I've already sold it. There's no buyback, right? 
shit. I accidentally sold it. There's no such thing as buyback. We'll find a new one? Yeah, alright. Well, let's, yeah, we'll find a new one. I don't want to, like, buy it back for an expensive fee. What is this one? Are, are any of you guys giving me quests? Few crowns I can polish your armor. Please. I, I'm so hungry. What does this do? What does polishing armor do? What does polishing my armor do? I don't know. It makes it shiny. <laughs> does it give me any bonus perks? That's the question. Come, come, take a look at my wares. Wares. Any mercenary who has spent a week in the wilderness, a simple wants, a small blade, a shaving brush, and a little free time. Barber kit, no. We don't want any of this. Leave. You touch it, you buy it. Uh oh, let's check. You touch it, you buy it. So I have food enough for four days, is my guess. I wonder if food spoils. Well, we always come back. Let's not worry about that. Is there anybody here that wants to give me a quest? More food than you have on at the moment. Yeah, okay. Apart from the Edorinian war refugees, that is. Say, it's not often that you see new faces around here, apart from the Edorinian war refugees, that is. Okay, sure. What is this? Buy for 24. Price temporarily reduced. Oh, I love a good deal. I love a good deal. Oh, there's a recipe here. Teaches you how to cook culture shock. Mutant stew, apple pancake, brandy. Oh, that's a, like an epic recipe, huh? They're only one day, usually. Against the short term. <laughs> Against the short term. Storm. Food, then you have on against the storm. There are only one day, usually. Okay. Hmm. I need a somebody who knows how to cook. Last until the next rest. Bonus. Reduce the speed at which troops fatigue stacks by 30%. Maybe make Rogue a stealer? How do I make him a stealer? He's not a rogue, he's a ranger. Is a ranger a rogue? A ranger's not a rogue, right? Yeah, see, he can't be a stealer. Click steal, I don't remember how. I don't want to steal the guy's stuff. None of this is really worth stealing. Maybe this, except for I don't have an experienced cook, so it's basically I'm lugging it around. But it might be a good idea to buy food, right? Sure, let's buy this. Brandy. Increases the troops happiness by one. Buy for three? Oh hey, it's not a bad deal. Feel free to come back often. There's always folk looking for work around here, especially since all the fighting started across the border. What is this? S uh, rest so that your troop can recuperate and recover. Three, three, three. What is this? Valor points. Use your valor points in combat to use certain skills. You'll regain some of them each time you rest. Hmm. Have to go to bed now. I'll watch the bot. Thanks for another amazing stream, Rod. It always makes my day better. Yeah, thank you for hanging out, Aquan. Appreciate that. Thank you for the resub yesterday. All right, well, let's go ahead and leave. I don't know. Should I rest? Maybe I should rest, right? Recover three. 
Hang on, let's leave first and see what this guy is. He's glowing green. No, no rest? Okay, no rest. Might she be looking for work? Our role as emissaries is to ensure that all service requests are fulfilled. We regularly update our job offers. Okay, let's take a job. Vanquish the Cathalethian gang. Uh, the recent increase in caravan raids is attributed to the Cathalethian Le Kathy Leth Gang, a bounty is offered to anyone who will put in an end, put an end to this nu uh, nuisance. Okay, wow, it's 185 coins for the reward. Unaware of the danger they face, a handful of Endorians have gone hunting in the Skithaz Forest. Someone must warn them, lest they get eaten. Help request help requested for the amateur hunters you have fatigue points with time to early to rest you have fatigue points with time to early to rest okay so so basically i will not need to rest oh what is what is this oh east and west oh okay which direction they're they're located okay well, this, this one sounds pretty straightforward, right? We go and warn them, and then we come back, right? Let's go ahead and take this. Oh, look at the map. Oh, okay, that's kind of cool. I like that. This map is nice. Very nice. And this is going to the east side, right? Wait, what, my map disappeared. I can only wait. I can only accept three contracts at a time, right? You know what? Let's go ahead and accept those. All right, that's not a bad direction either. I wish they would give us the location before we accept it, other than this generic east-west thing. That's fine. I'm okay with that. You. Yeah, you. You looking for work? Yeah, I kind of am. Give you tips and point you toward the best missions. The kind that pays much better than the measly rewards the mercenary guild has to offer. Okay. Of course, you'll then have to meet the client and meddle in other people's affairs. But at the end of the day, it's the number of crowns in your purse that counts. Okay, the money is called crowns. Okay. What is this? The wife of a man condemned to the gallows is desperately seeking help. Someone needs help in the abandoned tower, at least. That's what he's screaming out the window. That's what he's screaming out the window. Okay. A refugee is looking for the mercenaries who can fight as well as they can negotiate. Okay. The captain of the guard is looking for mercenaries to help him bring a criminal to justice. Oh. Hmm. Well, I do have some influence. You, your influence can be used to recruit new companions or perform certain actions. Oh, maybe I should save my influence to get recruits, right? All right, well, let's leave. I don't want to... Sp Blow all my influence. Okay, let's um hammer for hire. Find a blacksmith and bring him here. Oh. Okay. That's fine. Well, let's go to the easy one first. To the west, right? You can find all the quests yourself. It just if you want right now. Oh, okay. Got it. If I want it right now, I buy it. I don't want it right now. I want to go towards this. 
How do I leave? Oh, depart. Okay. Is there a way to have the mini map always on? Like a shortened version, like a, a small mini map window? Like, I'd like to have like a mini map. Run with mouse, double click, escape. Always open the option menu. Menus, okay, yeah. Um, what is else? Oh, show outlines of danger zones in combat. Enable. Allow the modification of skill orders in combat. I don't know what that is. Allow modification of the skill order in combat. Mm. Don't know what that is. What is this? Is there a mini map? World map? M? No. Nope. No. No mini map. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's a mini map. Okay. All right. Magnifier zoom. Tingoja, welcome back. Sixteen months sub resub there. Thank you for that. Thank you for resubbing today. I appreciate that very much. Hope you're doing well. Next chance I uh I get a new companion, I will name you. I will name that character Tingoja. Looking for another sub to name. But yeah, I appreciate that. Yeah, miss you too. Thanks for hanging out. All right, we're going to the loft, right? Yeah, so our companion, our party right now, are all subs. Ooh, some wolves want to fight us. Oh, we gotta go really far, huh? Oh, we've been going in the wrong direction. Have we been going in the wrong direction? I think we have. Well, we gotta fight the wolves anyways. Am I- have I been going in the wrong direction? I don't know. It looked like I was going in the wrong direction. You can go from forest- oh, oh, okay, 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 that's fine. So how many wolves do we- are we talking about here? Alright, it looks like it's three, right? Walking close to this trap could trigger it and deal heavy damage. Bear trap, okay. What is this? Rusty hatchet deals four damage to the target and applies destabilization. Guard is reduced to zero. Oh, okay. It's numbered before fight. Wolf three. Oh, okay. So it tells you how many at the, the start. Okay. I don't know if it's a good idea because the wolves probably rush and charge a lot faster that's 16 that's 16 okay what is the exclamation mark next unit be played oh okay okay all right let's run up to this guy then Well, these guys are turning their heads. <laughs> All right, let's um, let's rush up. And then we're gonna poison this dude. He's now poison. Nice. Oh my god, I love that new weapon that we got. How much damage? Nine, right? What about you? How much damage do you have left on you? Well, okay, we're gonna end turn, right? And then... Ten... Ooh, potential ten. Potentially ten. 
Well, it says three. It could go up to ten if it crits, right? Nice. Some actions grant temporary valor points that must be used before the battle ends or they will be lost. Okay, cool. Nice. I got it. Yes. Everybody's happy. Galvanization. Okay. All right. Okay. Alright, do I? Let's see here. Disengage and move it in a straight line up to to five meters in between units. Every time this unit kills an enemy, you gain one. Oh. Do I want to spend my thing? I don't know if I want to spend my thing. This this engages and move in a straight line up to five meters oh what's that what is that thingy hang on hang on what is this thingy wait cannot be used if this unit is engaged in combat Wait, what the hell is this item? What, what is that item? What is that thingy there? Rusty hatchet. Oh, do I just pick that up? Can I just pick that up? Is that how it works? Huh, I don't know what that is. Attack at red radius. Wait, what was that? Attack at red radius. I have to pick that up, right? And it, and it automatically attacks anyone in the red radius. I think that's how it works. Eight millimeter shot. I don't know what the hell that does. I can't do anything else, so I'm gonna go ahead and end that. All right, so Brian is done. I'm gonna walk up to this guy, and give him a little smack here. Nice. Attack at red radius. I'm not sure what you mean by that. So I don't know what this does, or what that means. Cannot be used if this unit is engaged in combat. Uh oh. No, he didn't get his shot in. All right, he didn't get his shot in. Oh, damn it. All right, that's the end of that guy, right? All right, he did not get very far. Okay. Right. Uh, let's see. You're already there, right? Let's go ahead and do this. Okay. What? Hang on. Hatch, right? Hatch. Nice. Your opponent. Oh, your opponents are demoralized and flee. Do you want to let them go and win the battle? Wait. What if I say no? Do I keep continuing? 
I should probably not let him go, right? Your opponents are demoralized and flee. Do you want to let them go and win the battle? What if I say no? Well, I want to kill the remaining guy. And get more loot, right? Yeah, I want to kill the guy and get more loot. No mercy? Yeah, no mercy is correct. Surround and engage enemy unit with two allies to get a bonus. I did that, right? So he's surrounded. I get a bonus. Nice. Smack that guy down. Nice. I got an achievement. Victory favors the brave and the bold. Win a fight using only temporary something. Only temporary something. I missed the... Only temporary BPs. I don't know what the hell BPs are. Your group is overtired. Your companions might die of exhaustion if you keep walking. You really should rest. Okay. Let's loot everything. Let's let's level up Aquin. What is this? Disengage and charge in a straight line. Deals 5 damage to all units in their path. Uh, apply slowdown for one round. Uh, you don't need food. Take energy off. Take energy of the sun. Uh, oh, first glade is blood flower. How nice. It's for Brian. Oh, 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 you're talking to Brian. You're talking to Brian. Okay, let me see here. What's this one? Uh, deals five damage to all units in an area. Applies two poison to the bleeding unit. Oh, okay. And what is this one? Deal five to six damage to the target and applies weakening for three rounds. Deal five damage to all units in an area. Applies two poison to the bleeding units. Disengages and charges in a straight line, deals 5 damage to all units in their path, and applies slowdown for one round. Interesting. Deals 5 damage to all units, so this is a charge. Deal 5 damage to all units in an area, and applies 2 bonuses. This is like a AoE smash. Deal 5 to 6 damage to the target, and applies weakening for 3 rounds. Well, the foxes are starving, so that's nice. Okay. I think weakening blow. Three is for a tank. Okay, that... I mean, Aquan could be a tank. I mean, he's got a shield. He's a brute, right? I mean, this is also an AoE damage. Deals five damage to all units in an area. Applies two poison to bleeding units. Uh, look image of armor. Heavy armor, he medium armor. What am I? What am I? Aquin is what? What kind of armor is this? It doesn't say. What's common? What the hell is this? Rag is probably not heavy, right? Or medium. I mean, I really don't have medium or heavy armor. Yeah, I mean, none of these guys have, like, heavy armor or medium. What's your, what's your deal? Every time this unit ends their turn next to an enemy and is not engaged in combat, you get one. Okay. 
Every time this unit kills an enemy, you gain one. Oh, okay. Every time this unit ends their turn next to an ally and is not engaged in combat, you gain one. Every time this unit ends their turn next to an enemy and is not engaged in combat, you gain one. Alright, I'll take this one. I'll take that one. Alright, ends our turn next to an enemy. Yeah, we're okay. So this means I get two points. This means I get one, right? You're saying the plus plus is I gain two points. Yeah, let's go with Dexterity. Oh, you're right. I do get two points. It's 9 to 11. Nice. Okay. And then Aquin. Inspect. Medium armor. Alright, I'm going to go with the medium. We, we should be able to find some medium armor later at some point. Willpower is plus two, right? More damage. What's willpower do? Used to boost the troops' morale in combat. Also increases their critical hit. This unit survives the first time. They should die in com. This unit survives the first time. They they should die in combat once per encounter. This unit survives the first time. They should die in combat once per encounter. Oh. All right, well, let's do that then. Wasn't he the one with the low willpower? Yeah, he had low willpower before. So that kind of balances it out. What is this? Relations. Your companion can form relations ranging from love to hate. Their relations can evolve through combat interaction as well as their closeness in camp, affecting the troops' overall happiness. Yeah, he he's not happy with Brian because Brian uh, took a shot at him. Uh, let's, let's continue. All right, am I going the right direction? I want to go west, right? No, I am going the right direction. That's west. Okay, yeah, that's west. Well, he should not have been in the way. <laughs> rest. Alright, so I should rest, right? Yeah, alright, let's camp. Alright, so I got an achievement called the Beehive. Have at least 10 companions assigned to different tools in your... So, oh. So, I don't have 10 companions, but okay. You can rest at a campfire in your camp. Uh, feed your troop and pay their wages to avoid unrest. Resting refills your fatigue meter, restores valor points, and speeds up time. Okay. Where's my fatigue meter? What's a fatigue meter? Is this the fatigue meter? What is a fatigue meter? Maybe that's fatigue meter, right? Is that little bar the fatigue meter? I'm guessing that's the fatigue meter, right? Because it's flashing. Yes? Okay, yes it is. Alright, cool. So I'm correct. And then... What is this? A thick, golden-tinged liquid ooze from a long gash across the trunk. Assigned woodcutters produce resin during rest. Oh. Do I have a woodcutter? I don't have a woodcutter, right? I have zero out of one. Oh, that sucks. Without profession, without profession. Okay, he's a novice blacksmith. A small makeshift workstation that your companion can use to create many useful items. Assigned tinkers produce, assigned tinkers produce um, raw materials during each rest. Do I have a tinker? I don't think I have a tinker. Okay. 
Who's, who needs the crit hit? All right, why don't we give Brian the Tinker ability or profession, and that way he gains crit hit. Okay. You don't teach you don't teach discovery group skill on book at the right. What do you mean? You don't teach discovery group skill on the book at the right. What do you mean? What do you mean? What, uh, am I missing something? Oh, there's something down here. What is this? What does this do? What does this do? Basic knowledge. Running, rationing, fatigue, smooth talker, cannibalism. Ooh, cannibalism. Your troop is prepared to do anything to survive, including eating their own. You can now devour a human corpse. Ooh. Interesting. Those dead people. Maybe it's good to, to get this, right? Is that everybody, or is it just... What is knowledge versus... What is that? Okay, hang on. Can learn blueprints at four of them, yeah. It's for all the groups. Okay, so it's for the entire group. Got it. All right, that's good. So what should I do here? Should I get cannibalism? Your companions are honing their cr criminal skills and learning to, to master the art of stealth. The suspicion meter depletes 10% faster. Your companion are ready to fight and shine with glory on the battlefield. Maximum valor points increased by one. You can run for short periods of time. Perfect for getting away from pursuits. Rationing. Your companions are now more sensible and ration their food. The troop eats three less food. Oh, that might not be so bad. Weight training. Your troop has trained with weights and can now carry heavy loads over long distance. Carrying capacity is increased. Okay. Frugal. Each companion agrees to cut their wages for the greater good. Wages paid to companion reduced by 10%. Ooh. Frugal, huh? Frugality. Smooth talker. Your companion becomes great spokesperson. Per, spokespersons who can talk anyone into joining their ranks. Recruitment of cost of companions reduced by 10%. Ooh. Location marker. Your troop can add objective markers to the map using uh, right click. Interesting. Less food looks good. Yeah. Rationing, right? Yeah, I think rationing is probably a good idea. Alright, let's learn this. Yes, we now have rationing. And now, what else? Who who has tinker use? Brian, right? What can Brian do? Oh. Oh, Brian can craft a lockpick for us. Brian can craft a fish hook. We don't have enough resources. Oh, it's kind of cool. We can craft stuff. I don't know. Lock picking, right? The small lock pick can be used to open locks that separate a thief from their loot. Interesting. We only have one iron ore. Sure, let's let's uh craft a lockpick. Nice, you got a little skill there. You can broke it's like Skyrim. What do you mean you can broke it? It's like you can break stuff with like it's like Skyrim, right? I actually have not played Skyrim. My friend gave me like the full game as a gift once, like the ultimate edition of some sort, and I have motion sickness, and playing Skyrim-like games with a center point makes me nauseous. I feel bad, because he gave me, like, a full-blown game. Alright, so lockpick now gets me the ability to open stuff, right? I'll take it. 
cool. All right, what else can I do here? Blacksmith. Choose a profession. Must be a tinker. Oh, you're not a tinker. Okay, I got it, I got it, I got it. Okay. Hang on. What, what does it say? A sign to repair something. How do I repair? Or it says a sign to craft. Uh, shift place in inventory, use, and move. What does a shift place in inventory mean? Your companion are very fond of their workshop and refuse to remove it from the camp. Okay. What about move? What is this? I don't have anything for this, right? He gave you loot after rest. Oh, oh. He gave you loot after rest. Oh, okay. Now he produces the tools or the materials. Is that does that material come from something I currently have, or does it magically appear? Move hero, not table. Oh, you can move here. Oh. Okay, have at least ten companions assigned to different tools here. Oh. Oh, it's just a checkoff. It's not a um, progression. Okay, so it's active. So what happens at the end of the turn? Do I magically get free whatever the hell that is, tools or raw materials? Or do I, do I lose something to make it? Do I lose something? Does that make sense? It's passive, so I don't lose anything. I just automatically get it for free. Oh, so I get raw materials for free. So should I repair? I guess I should repair then, right? I'm going to get two for free at the end of the turn. So yeah, okay, all right. So now I can just sleep, right? Wages to pay is zero. Meals. Should I eat? Should I eat something? How do I know if I need to eat something? How do I know if I need to eat? Like, do I... Are they hungry? I mean, is it, or is it like something that says, hey, you gotta eat it? Huh, I don't know, it doesn't say. Eat every rest? I should eat every rest. You must feed your companions before each rest. Make sure you have enough food and stock. It says I must. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, the happiness. Oh, okay. Got it. Now I rest. Oh, so I add food to make sure that they're not unhappy. Got it. Got it. Got it. So if I don't have food, they're unhappy. Sure. Let's go ahead and rest. Good you don't have harpies. <laughs> the troop is well rested. You have you have gained something. Valor points. I gained two valor points. Your troop's happiness is increased by plus two. Plus two companions assigned to the campfire. Uh, your troop's happiness is, is seven. Your companions are pleased. You have gained the following bonus. Maximum valor increased by one. The camp has produced resources. Nice. Okay. I'm happy. So now we break camp, right? We. How do we leave? 
Do we just hit C and break camp? You can make more different structures in camp. Okay. Do we leave? Do we leave? I think we leave, right? Oh wait, what's this? Oh. Your troop can uh, add passive markers. Your companion become spokesperson. What is this? Frugality. Reduce their wage. Let's reduce their wage. Yeah, let's reduce their wage. Okay, so do I leave now? I'm, I'm guessing C leaves, right? Okay. And then we need to keep going, right? Now what what is that icon over their face? By the way, if you don't have work left, let them sit fire, it's good for happy. I see. You miss one, then rest. Alright, hang on. Alright, we're going the right direction. Cool. Yeah, I love world map exploration. It's fun. This is nice. And then encountering things as you move around the world. I love these type of games. Oh, they can't go around that cliff, huh? Alright, how much further? Oh, okay. Should I go to town? I'll, I'll, I'll come back to that town later. I just want to get towards my destination first. Must be the hunters, right? That need help. How do I talk to them? How do I talk to them? There we go. We came to hunt for food for our families, but the animals here, their calls are enough to make your hair stand on end. Oh, you mean go to town just in case they might have other quests? Who knows? Yeah, I, I get you. I understand. True. I could, probably could have stacked like additional quests. Um, sure. Okay. Their calls aren't enough to make their hairs stand on end. Okay. I to wonder if we did the right thing coming here. But now that we're here, we can't go back empty-handed. Um. Wait, do we give them anything? No, we, we don't have any food. Okay, explain that, that this mountain is extremely dangerous for inexperienced hunters, require uh, influence, and reward promise rope. Okay, yeah, let's do that. Yes. I see. Thank you for warning us. We were venturing into unknown territory. Okay. Thanks to you, we'll get back to our families, safe and sound. Okay, so we completed our reward, right? We get ropes. And we also got money, right? I got some achievement. Workaholic, complete 100... Uh, I don't know what that is. I didn't complete 100 con contracts. Maybe it's just like a counter checkoffs. So do I go back to town to claim my reward, or do I just... Or, or my, the ropes was my reward. Where's my quest? Where's my quest? Where's the journey? Where's my quest book? Where's my quest book? Is there a quest book? Is there a quest book? Oh, here we go. Did I get money? I didn't get paid. I didn't get paid yet. 
I think it says you need to report to the emissary to get money, right? You must pay your companions of every wage. Okay, so 90 is... Is... Is what I will get later, right? Uh, wages is something that's coming up. Fulfilled contracts is something I'll get. Okay, so I have to go back to town to get the money. Okay, that's fine. Okay. But since we're here, let's loot some stuff here. Gather some stuff. So that way we can do some crafting later. I love crafting stuff too. It's kind of cool. Collecting, gathering stuff to craft is good. I love those type of games. We need to get another party member. Shift run? I think there was like double click, right? I could probably just do double click. Wasn't there like double click to run? Run with mouse, double click, right? Enable. I don't know. Oh, let's find out. No, I think I have to learn it first. I don't have run skill. I don't have run skill yet. I have to learn it. I remember I, I didn't take it. I can only walk. All right, let's go back to that town. Yeah, okay, so it's south. It's east, right? So we're going back to the town. Oh, what's going on over here? What's going on over here? Inspect. Ooh. I get leather, huh? I'll take it. I can't go down that mountain, right? No, I can't go down that mountain. Oh, man. Alright, well, let's go to town. And see what town has for us. The wealthy farm, huh? It's not a town, it's a farm. Ooh, this chick looks like she has something for us. She's glowing. Let's go ahead and click on her. All seeing eye. Are our last hope. I swear I will find a way to pay you. Okay. It sounds like you have no money. You must warn my husband's friends. They need to come and help him. Yes, ask them to come. If only they could speak in his favor. Reason with the people who want to kill him for a handful of grain. I don't know. After playing that Diablo. Some town folks asked me to do some things, and I don't know. Gathering his friends, and they're, they're gonna all attack me. I don't know. But the reward sounds really nice, right? Reward promise, bar of soap, some influence, and plus 20 of something. What is that other icon? No wood at this farm. What is that plus 20 icon? What is that plus 20 icon? Sure, I'll take it. My husband only told me that his friends live north of the lake, not far from here. Please come back quickly. Regional influence. Oh, okay. Regional influence. Thank you for that information, random Dutch dude. Oh, what's this guy? I'm terribly sorry. I shouldn't have agreed to this, but we'd run out of food and we were starving. You're starving. The village chef. Take pity on this scoundrel. He fled his home country to come and steal our crops. Uh oh. There was some wood slash chess or grass on the different farm on different farms. Okay. 
This Ederanian leech will be strung up for his crime. And soon, we'll all sleep easy. Uh oh. Okay, I don't want to steal that. There was some wood slash chest or grass on different farms. Do I do I look for stuff around here? No, all right. Oh. Oh. I picked up hemp. It's free, right? I think I picked it up for free. Is that is that what you were talking about? The free loot? The grass on the floor? I think that's that's what you were talking about, right? The grass on the floor. There's nothing else I can click on, right? Always look for hemp or chopping blocks. Yep, yep. Oh, okay, so that's what you were talking about. I can't click on anything else, right? Alright, this is good. Alright, so this chick asked us to go save some dude. Find a blacksmith. Warn the convicts, uh, convince man's friends north of the lake. Where, wait, where is that? Where is that? It's not on the map. Interesting. It's not on the map. North, right? She said north. North of the lake. I don't know if it's a good idea to travel during, through the storm. Oh, maybe I should rest. It's a blinking thingy. What is this fatigue? Check your troops of fatigue to know when you need to, to set up camp and rest. Use the campfire to cook a nice meal and get some rest. I can keep going, right? Or no? Oh, I should probably rest before engaging in combat. Okay. Ooh, I can make a torch. Well, no, not yet. I need cloth. Ooh, what was this? When driven into a rock, this spike can be used to hang a rope and descend from steep heights. Oh, okay, that's kind of cool. I can make ropes. I can make a tent if I get cloth. Hitching post. Okay, nothing there. Bad idea to combat while fatigued. Yes, definitely a bad idea. I agree. What does that say? How do I put this guy down by the campfire? There you go. Oh, okay, there you go. Deals damage? Oh, it does fight, huh? It's kind of cool. Alright, let's go ahead and use this, right? Use this. And I need 12 food. I need 8, right? And Sims 2? How about this? Oh, okay. The melting apple pie, oh, sorry, the melting apple smells of sweet caramel. Uh, reduces the speed at which the troops fatigue stacks by 30%. Lasts until the next rest. Oh. Okay. Add to meal. There we go. 
Danger level is average. When dangers abound, an attack can occur while your troop rests. Oh. 20% chance of danger. Your troop is well rested. You gained two valor. Your troop's happiness is increased by three. Plus three companions assigned. Plus three companions assigned to the campfire. Oh, hap plus three happiness because there's companions assigned to the campfire. Your troop's happiness is ten. Your companions are pleased. Nice. Very nice. What is this? Oh, shit. Shit. Oh, okay, that doesn't penalize me. Do I attack these guys? I don't know if I should attack them. There's three of them. I'm supposed to warn somebody, right? North? You can ambush an en enemy on world map too. Okay. Well, she she gave me some quest. Warn the convicted man's friends north of the nearby lake. Were those people the folks I needed to warn? Or do I need to go further? It's pretty vague. Yeah, well, it's pretty vague. You miss. You miss the right path. What do you mean? I miss right path. It was left. You go right. Oh. This direction. Am I going the right direction? Hang on. Left side of the lake. Oh, I see it. There's like some sort of question mark, I think. Oh, I think it's right over there. Oh, I think it was over there. Shit, I went around the wrong direction. Yeah, I think I know what happened there. She said north, right? Okay. I probably should have ambushed them first. There's three of them, right? Okay. That guy is a melee. That guy is also a melee. They're all 916s. Wasn't it? Yeah, they're all they're all the same. Henchmen, henchmen, and raiders. Okay. And this is a bear trap. Where's my... Archer? Where's Brian? Where's Brian? Oh, he's in the back. Okay. Hmm. Now, I think he, Annie, has the ability to get points when he's not the one engaged, right? And he runs up afterwards. What the hell is that? What, what was that? What does that icon mean? 
Required movement doubled. What does that mean? Why is it mud? Oh, he's in mud. Oh, if you go there, you're in mud. I see. I see. Oh, that's also mud. They're all, oh my god, they're all mud. I see. That's why they suggest me going there. I see. Where's my other guy? He's over there, right? That's mud. Oh. Okay, alright, alright. All right, so let's see here. Aquin could probably hold his own. Well, he's gonna be surrounded by two guys. Maybe I, maybe I'm okay with this. I'm okay with this. Yeah, alright, I'm okay with this. Alright, well, hang on. Maybe Brian doesn't need to move that far, right? Because he's actually a range guy. So I need to move Aquin first, and then I'll, I'll go in with Annie. And then we're good, right? 16 points. Alright, let's do this. What is this? Oh, yeah. All right, we're gonna smack you. And we're gonna get, we're gonna end Aquin's turn. And we're gonna get you, oh wait, he, he gotta end his turn first. Oh, he, oh, never mind. he's already in his turn. All right, so we're gonna move him right up to there. And then we're gonna attack him. He's poisoned. Right. Every time this unit ends their turn next to an enemy and is not engaged, you gain one. Okay, yep. There you go. Right. That's fine. Alright, no biggie, right? No biggie. Okay, do I want that? Or do I want to run up to this guy? Let's run up to this guy and smack him. Alright, and then we're gonna smack this guy. What's this guy's ability? Weakening, right? Forces the target to engage and inflicts weakening to them for one round. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's passive, right? Or no, oh, it's a not a passive ability. Wait, wait. Forces the target to engage and inflicts weakening to them for one round. Is it better to weaken them or just attack them? Just, no, uh, well, let's go ahead and attack him. He's now engaged anyways. Oh I, can, oh, I can weaken him again, right? Oh, I can do both. Yeah, 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 yeah. Very nice. It's point spendability. Got it, got it, got it. I can do both. Uh oh, Aquan is still good, right? 
Yes, Aquan is good. And now Brian. What does this one say? Disengage and move in a straight line up to five meters between units. Okay, that's cool. So let's um Let's try to uh, attack the other guy. And what why is it highlighted? Oh my god, I might have a chance of attacking him, huh? I have a chance of hitting him, right? Oh, okay, there we go. Nice. Okay. Yeah, so that that's that little star meant that it was fr friendly fire splash damage potential. Okay. Do I want to just attack him? Oh, come on! Oh my god. Fail. Fail, 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 fail. And Brian's turn. Oh my god, I should have killed this guy first. Wait, hang on. I can only attack him with it. Oh my goodness. Fail, fail, fail! Look at portraits. Who goes next to kill... To kill major targets. Yeah, I should've probably done that sooner. These Aquans gonna get attacked. Oh my goodness. Well, it's just his armor. Not terribly bad. Hang on, this guy. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. He's gone, right? And then it's my guy. Okay, who's next? This guy. Nice. Ooh, nice, 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 nice. Your opponent are demoralized and flee. Do you want to let them go and win the battle? No. <laughs> yeah, we, we want we want all the amazing loot. Alright, so one more round, right? 14? Okay. Oh, I can still attack him, huh? Oh, that's kind of cool. I can attack him again, right? No, every time. No, 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 no. End turn. And then. Alright, you know what? Act one can just probably smack him. Yeah, baby. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Nice! Very nice. Loot this. Take it. Let's repair all, right? I'm okay with repairing all. Alright, the hatch now gets a point. It does five to six damage to target and applies destabilism, de destabilization, destabilization. De yeah, destabilization. De okay. 
the unit and all allies in the area gain protection for two rounds. Ooh. The the unit and all allies in the area gains protection for two rounds. Deals five to six damage to the target and applies use of stabilization for two rounds. There is a cumulative system for the number of enemies released. So sometimes you can... Can what? Sometimes you can what? Uh, deal six damage to all units in the area two in, in an area two times usable after two attacks huh deal six damage to all units in the area two times let let them left them go from the battle alive there's a cumulative system for the number of enemies released so sometimes you can let them go from the battle so what is that if I let them go what happens? The unit and all allies in area gain protection for two rounds. What is oh? Five to six units to the target and applies destabilization for two rounds. What is destabilization? Guard reduced to zero. Oh. Okay. Six damage to all units in an area two times. Interesting. Unusable uh, in the area two times, and usable after two attacks. Five to six damage to target and applies. Okay, this is all units, right? All units. Sure, let's feel all units. Alright, what do you got for me? Willpower is plus two. Crit hit chance, yeah, let's go with that. Okay, alright, we're doing good. Continue. Oh, hey, there's something here. All right. Food, right? I think that was food. Oh, I just picked up some food. Mushrooms or whatever it was. What is this? Bread. Yeah, I really like this game. I do like this game a lot. What is that one? What the hell did I just pick up? Was that mushroom? I can't tell. These icons are so hard to tell. Wood, right? That was probably wood. Was it progress towards something, right? Alright, what is this? For money, right? Crowns gained after battles increased by 5%. Companions will search bodies in the most in congruous places to find crowns okay what's this one your companions are ready to fight and shine with glory in the battlefield maximum valor increased uh your companion are honing their criminal skills okay suspicion meter depletes 10 percent faster okay you can now learn devour human corpse right do i want to eat this Human corpse, right? Hmm. Tasty, right? Cannibalism. I think more money, right? After each battle, it's probably better to make more money. Or money. What's this? It's shiny. What was that? Oh, it's probably whatever this is. Comfy. Alright, are you friends with some somebody? I don't want to steal from these guys, right? Can I take anything off of this? Do I... Do I... Do I get free grass somewhere? 
Is there free grass here? Nothing, right? One of our new recruits hasn't returned from his first assignment. I'm starting to worry. Stealing grain should be quick and easy. Something must have gone terribly wrong. Uh oh. He probably just got delayed. He seemed hmm. capable enough for a refugee. One of your friends is to be hung from the gallows. Oh, caught red handed on his first try. I never should have recruited a simple farmer. He just doesn't have it in him. Uh oh. He cannot hang by my fault. Pack it up, lads. We are leaving. As for you, come and meet me at the farm. We could do with your help. Uh oh. No, no. I just want my money. I just want my money. Oh, they packed it up. Oh, it's not stealing anymore, right? It's not considered stealing anymore, right? I think that's not stealing, right? Let's just take. Free loot. She said, pack it up, lads. Yeah, it's not stealing anymore. They're gone. Oh, okay. Well, that was free. I, I like free. Free is a good deal. What is that loot icon? Oh, it means that you are carrying too much. Oh. What is this? What is this? What, what is this? What do I do? Wait, how do I get the companion thingy back again? Let's see, your corpse? Oh, it's because the corpse are, are heavy. Yeah, the corpse are heavy. Each compa companion's carrying capacity is decreased by one. You have five companions in, uh, in your troop. Oh, the fifth is the horse. Um, general bonuses. Experience gain in combat is increased by 10%. Influence gain after battle is increased by 10%. Each companion's carrying capacity is decreased by one. Maximum valor points is increased by one. Increase your troop's happiness by three. You take two raw... Materials during each rest. Okay. Uh, bonus until your next rest. Okay. Now I have this thing. What is this? Oh. Reward one PPP. Do I do I take this? Do I take it? I guess I take it, right? Oh, I guess I just I just collect it. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so as I go up, I, I gain something. Collect resources. Reward one TPP. Craft five tier recipes. Oh. This is like just a... A meta thingy. It's kind of like a Diablo's meta thingy. Oh my god, my, my guys are moving really slow. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm four over. You can have the achievement also multiple times. Oh, okay. I probably should have taken Campbell to leave corpse. How do I leave it? How do I leave one? Can I take, can I break it? How do I break it up in half? How do I, how do I shift click, right? I can't shift click it. Sort inventory. How do I break it up in pieces? Is there a way to like split it? What's the split command? Control? Oh, control. 
You want to drop one human remain, yes. It's it's a control, the control key. Break corpse in on pieces. <laughs> Just leave them all. You don't need them unless you want to go cannibalism. I was thinking about going cannibalism. To get some food. Or sell it, right? We can sell it. For two coins. Uh-oh. Something's going on in the farm. What, how, I need to get paid. Worrisome delay. Sentence to death. Follow mission instructions to complete the objective? I did that already. You want to walk up to the merchant and ask him if he wants to buy a corpse. I think he will call the guards. <laughs> Let's find out. Hey, would you like to buy my corpse? Oh, you're moving too fast for me. Come on! Slow down! Oh shit, they're moving away. Damn it. I need to probably rest. I need to probably rest. Oh wait, here's a new group coming. Here's a new group coming. Stop where you're at. Hello. There you go. Interest you in my humble wares, my good sirs. Yeah. Would you like to buy my corpse? I can sell it for, for one, right? Yes, I got some money. Two coins. Do I want to buy this guy's humble wares? No, right? This axe was designed to chop wood, but it's used for something different. Oh. Let's see here. No, we're good, right? We're, we don't want to... We, yeah, we don't want to attack him. Leave. Kind of cool you can attack him. Oh, you know what? Let's rest. What is this? Monolith. The stone has no particular meaning for ordinary mortals, but a scholar might learn something unexpected from it. I have no scholars. Can I craft anything? I still need cloth. No, I don't have anything here to craft. Okay, no. Alright, well, nothing else, right? Okay, now let's, let's take a look at the... This... Axe, right? Strength deals 90 to 70 to 90 percent strength damage. Strength is plus two. I mean, it looks like a, it's a common axe. Wait, okay, this is what? This is five to six, right? Plus two strength. That's only plus one strength. Slice versus bravado. What's bravado? What's slice? 5 to 6? Bravado is 5 to 6. But I get plus 2 strength. Can I equip it? The hatch cannot equip this type of weapon. Oh, the hatch can't equip it. Alright, how about Aquan? Aquan cannot equip this type of weapon. Come on. And then Agitator cannot equip that type of weapon. Brian obviously can't, right? Yeah, Brian cannot. Okay, so no one can equip this type of weapon. I should have sold it earlier. I should have inspected that earlier and then s sell it off. Okay, well, fail. What's this? No. Pony. All right, you know what, Tengoja, I'm gonna call you, I'm gonna give you the p pony. My pony is now called Tingoja. 
King Goja, since you are a companion. So, Tengoja, you are the pony. Alright, let's go ahead and use this. Alright, that's, that's here. Animal remains? Sure, eat it. I need a four-pointer, right? There you go. Or two, two points. Eat the carcass. The weight is a lot. Two, yeah. Wait, what? One, two, and one, one. Why is it? Is it auto? Is, is that what it's doing? Is auto? Insufficient food minus one. There you go, right? When you will be at a town, make cook profession. Okay, yeah, I'll I'll make a cook profession. Okay, you, your troops' happiness is increased by plus three. Plus three companion assigned to the campfire. Yes, your troops' happiness is 13. Your companions are pleased. Nice. Alright, well, I'm glad you're pleased. And I need to go into the farm, right? Collect my loot. It's it's economy food by cooking and passive, uh, ref, uh, and passive refuse with hero at boiler. My husband only told me that his friends live north of the lake, not far from here. I already. Back quickly. I did. I. Oh my god. We'll reduce. Oh, not refuse. We'll re reduce with hero at boiler. Oh, okay. I hear shouting. Could you go and see what that is all about? Uh, hello. I already already warned the friends. I already warned your friends. Why don't you give me your reward? You promised me a reward. What's going on here? You promised me a reward. What? Where's my reward? All right. Well, I guess we're, we're going to have to take care of this. Over here. Hello? Hello? Release the refugee immediately. But you, you brought bandits, mercenaries. Are you willing to let them slaughter us to save a thief? Uh oh. He's just a desperate farmer. Let him go, and no harm will come to you. Who's to say you won't be back in a few days to plunder our supplies? No. We won't let any of you leave. Very well. Have it, you. Uh-oh. Mercenaries, whatever those thieves promised you, I can pay you much more to defend us. We'll even forget you were ever involved in this. I can pay you much more to defend us. Oh. Do I make a choice? Oh my goodness. Oh, here we go. I have a choice. Well, he promised me much more, right? Whatever they promise you, I can pay you much more. Oh my god, how do I do this? Interact with the fight? Wait, gets... 
What does this say? Adjusted straps. What the hell does that mean? Get bars, bar of soap. What the hell is bar of soap versus adjusted strap? I think adjusted strap is better than bar of soap, right? What, what what's what's the bar of soap? Items on hero. Yeah, well, I would like to inspect the bar of soap versus the adjusted straps. What is the difference? What's the difference? I can't choose. Oh my god, I can't look at my thing. Oh, there we go. Bars of soap or adjusted straps. What does bar of soap do for me? Hmm, not possible to check before you have it in inventory. Yeah. Well, that's kind of lame. I'd like to know what I'm getting. Like, it's like, what? what's my reward? What does it really mean? Maybe I can Google this. War Tales. Bar of Soap. Oh, yes. Other people are asking the same thing. Soap. Minus suspicion when stealing... Uh, when you steal straps. Okay. Um, how to get and what does it do? The Bar of Soap is a potential quest reward from starting zone. Follow the path. Okay. Um... It's fine, though. It's just early equipment. Is the bar of soap worth getting? Somebody asked. If you intend to embark on a life of crime in War Tales, the bar of soap is definitely worth having. The item itself is a backpack a backpack belt accessory. A companion with a thief profession can equip it to reduce the suspicion they gain when stealing by 10%. Okay. And what was the other one? Straps, right? Backpack strap. Straps. What is that? Backpack straps, right? You can craft those later. Alright, so let's go with the... Adjustable straps, then. Two allies. Ooh, I get two allies. Oh, I get two allies. Oh, no. Why does he get two allies? Ringleader. I get bar of soap as I attack him. Oh. Uh, versus the other one. I get adjustable straps. Huh. I don't know where I'm getting these allies from, but okay. Who are the allies? Who are these allies? Oh! The chief joins me versus the other one. The wife and so-and-so. Or the bandits join me, right? Got it. Alright, well, I, you know what? Bandits are bad people. Let's go ahead and attack. Oh, okay. Bandits are bad. We're gonna take the adjustable straps. I don't know. Some characters are important. If they die, the battle will end. Important allied characters must be protected and important enemies captured. Okay. Okay. What, what, what am I? What is this guy? Village chief, right? I think he's an ally, right? 
Oh, he's an ally, right. Oh, okay, so he must... He must survive. What is this thing? I can never figure out what the hell this thing is. Cannot be used if this unit is engaged in combat. Do I just walk up to this and then use it? Oh my god. We don't want it to be the backside, right? Free attack. Oh, okay. Free attack. Hoodlum, hoodlum, marauder. Isabella, poacher, and marauder. She's 24, 34. Oh, she's got pretty big damage. Okay, okay. When you move a unit to it, you can throw it like a spear, but you must not touch an enemy. Got it, got it. Must, must not be engaged, right? Can, cannot be used if this... If unit is if this unit is engaged in combat. Okay. And my chief needs to survive. Brian. Hatch. Okay, Aquin will protect these guys. Okay. Well, hang on. What's your damage? What's this guy's damage? What's his damage? So, ooh, 6 to 17? Wow, that guy's got a lot of damage. Alright, so I need to probably walk up with one of my dudes. And throw... Yeah, okay, let's go with this guy. Hang on, no, no, no. Not Brian. Cancel. This dude, right? Oh, he can't walk. Oh my god, he can't walk. During their turn, this unit will move. Wait. During their turn, this m unit will move and attack nearby targets. During their turn, this unit will move and attack nearby targets. Oh, I can't control him. Got it. I can't control him. So that means Brian then moves. Okay, let's put Brian. Right here. Alright, Brian. Can I can I click on this? Ryan, how do I how do I do this? Hello? I can't get a free shot. What's going on? Strength hero uses spear better. Oh, I see. A little further into the red square. Oh. Okay. Foot soldier. That's this guy. That guy moves. Okay, alright, alright. So. Do I run? Do I get a free run? Travels to that spot over there. How do I change my facing direction? Is there a way to change facing direction? Well, it's fine. It's automatic, I guess. Nice. Uh-oh.
All right, the hatch. Nice. Okay. I'm not engaged, right? I could go right here, right? Or no? Wait. Wait, why can't I... I can't use this. Cannot be used if this unit is engaged in combat. I'm not engaged in combat, right? Already engaged with other character. Well, it's not... I don't have an engaged icon, though. I don't have an engaged icon. Interesting. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Far away? Oh. Wait, who? It was my turn, right? My turn. Wait, what? Okay, hang on. Oh, there you go. It lights up. Nice. Can I move? I can, oh, I can still move. Nice! Free move. Got it. Free move. Very nice. Uh-huh. Alright, you do your thing now. Don't hit me, though. Don't hit me! Okay. At least you're not an idiot. All right, all right. Digging it, digging it. Oh my god, Aquan. Took a beating. He definitely took a beating. Okay. I can't go again right now. I can't go again. Okay, I can't go again. Can't go again. That means it's only you, Agitator. And we're gonna smack this guy. Do I get another move? I can't get moved. Oh no. Oh, I'm engaged in it. Oh, okay, 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 okay. All right, I think that's the end of that one, right? Shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's bad, 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 bad. Annie, you're not going to make it. Who gets a free shot if I... I think it's Brian, right? I think Brian gets a free shot if he, if he, if he, um, if he wins. Right, I think, I think he gets his free valor or free whatever the hell points. Oh, come on. Oh, God. Oh, I have a risk of chance, right? Risk of chance of hitting this guy. Wait, Marauder is also a bad guy, right? Oh, there's nothing wrong with hitting a Marauder. Yes. I gained a free point. All right. I thought that was one of my own guys. Oh, no, 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 no! Oh! 
A dying unit can only move if you heal them before they take damage. A dying unit can only move if you heal them before they take damage. They will they will be able to fight again. If not, they will permanently be lost. Wait, 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 what? A dying dying unit can only move if you heal them before they take damage. They will be able to fight again. If not, they will be permanently lost. Well, what happens? What happens? Did I lose him? What, what? Do I save him? Can I save him? Can I save him? I can't save him, right? Oh, come on! I have first aid skill, right? I can save him, right? Oh, he's still alive. One of your people has first aid. Yeah, okay. I, I, I'm still alive. Can he move? No, he can't move. Shit, I can't. No, I can't, right? I'm, I accidentally hit her. Smack. Okay, who's next? That guy. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, I should have moved first. Oh. Wait, can I disengage? Oh, oh, sh oh, come on. Disengage was a bad idea. Disengage was a bad idea. This guy, no, who has... Oh, no! Aquaman's gonna die, huh? Is there an undo? Shit! Aquaman's gonna die. Oh, well, this battle's not looking good, guys. This battle's definitely not looking good. I have no more first aid. Unless this guy has... No, this guy doesn't have first aid. That guy doesn't have first aid. You cannot use a skill if the companion is dying. This is not looking good, guys. Oh, no. Aquan died. No, Mike. Brian's got low health. Who's next? Isabel, right? Poacher. And then Marauder. Hmm. Can I use her myself? Oh, I can't use her myself. I need to get the hell out, right?
Uh oh, Brian's gonna take it. Oh, come on! <laughs> no! Brian is not gonna make it. Good night and good luck. Yeah, I think. Oh, Brian is not gonna make it. Oh, Brian is dead. Oh my goodness. Oh, my party is dead. <laughs> Back one's down. Brian's down. Two down. I only have two left, right? And, and Annie is almost dead. Annie is almost dead. Oh shit. Let's get the hell out. He will go to Valhalla. Come on. <laughs> okay. Oh shit. This is bad, guys. A new round is starting. Can I resurrect people? Are there is there such thing as going to a priest and resurrecting somebody? I think I guess when you're dead, you're dead, right? I'm pretty sure you're dead, you're dead. And he has first aid. Oh, yeah, Isabella. The hatch unlocked. Glorious. Hatch is still alive. Foot soldier. Oh, come on. You had to go through poison. We've got one, two, three, four, five guys left, and we only have two, four. Four versus four, right? It's four versus four. Annie cannot heal herself. I should probably stay there, right? Or no? No, I should move out. I should move out. Because, uh... He's engaged. I'm not. Oh! Oh! My foot soldier. We're not gonna make it, guys. Oh! We're not gonna make it, guys. We're definitely not gonna make it. I think I picked the wrong side. I picked the wrong team. Stay to point and then they will take like friendly fire. Oh, Annie is going down. No. Oh my God. I think my entire party. Oh, the hatch is still around. Oh, I can still, I can still do one attack. Oh, I can't do anything. Oh, I can't do anything. You cannot use the skill. The companion is dying. Oh. Oh, God. Well, the companion is dying, so I can't do anything. Yet. Let's die with honor. You're about to die. Oh! Oh! Oh my god, that was so brutal. <laughs> oh my god. Rip. Rip. Oh no. I don't think I can take care of these guys. One, two, three. Oh my god, three. Four! Four. Pick the wrong team here. Oh, 
All right, three to two. Leader, dude. Leader, dude, you gotta... You gotta pull your weight here. Oh my god. Oh my god. All right, the bandits were not a group to mess with. We are done for. The pony is still alive, though. Oh, come on, you are scared chicken shit. I should have sided with the uh, the bandits. Definitely should have sided with the bandits. There's no way I can survive this. Can I retreat? Uh, not today. Retreat from combat. I got achievement. In and out. Nobody gets hurt. Heal all. Repair all. The hatch is still alive. Well, at least the hatch and Tingoja is there. Continue. Mm, that was really bad. The group is looking healthy. <laughs> Oh boy, oh my god, I got all this armor. No, I think this is the end of the run, guys. This is the end of the run. I definitely enjoyed this game. War Tales, very, very fun. So yes, next time I will... Now I know how to play the game. Next time we will form a better... A better team. Do I... Do I... I guess it's just return the menu, right? Yeah. If you want to return the main menu, all progress will be lost. Yeah, let's let's go back. All right, guys. This is the end of today's stream. Uh, this is War Tales, a game that I got from Shuro Games. Thank you, Shuro Games, for the free game key so that I can stream this. I definitely enjoyed the game, and I will probably play more of this. This is something I definitely enjoyed. So next time, we will form a better party, and now that we know how to play a little bit more, maybe next time we will survive a little longer. Alright guys, thank you so much, and uh, I will see you tomorrow when we continue our Against the Storm Run Prestige Climb Challenge with no Citadel Upgrade. Yes, thank you for the stream. Yeah, thank you for hanging out. Another sub lurk in here. Thank you for that. Next time we will add you to the the party there. Neff. All right, guys. Um, hang tight, and I will find somebody to raid. So hang tight. And I'll see you tomorrow.